Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It's episode 139, and we're continuing our playthrough of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. We uh, landed on Malachor 5. We've been exploring these ruins, killing these lizard people, and uh, wishing we could make a nice liz lizard skin robe. I mean, it'd be wasteful to let those skins just sit there and rot, right? Uh, and Mira had a confrontation with um, Hanhar, and I think that's the last one. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Let's, uh, all right. Hi. We can actually go into battle this time when I click go into battle. All right, we're going to actually go into battle this time when I click go into battle. And that did nothing. All right, these are the critters that we've been fighting all this time. I have no idea what that dude did in the background, but it doesn't seem to have done much. I mean, it looks like it's a special... Uh, maybe it's a buff? I don't know. Something that he's doing to psych himself out? Like, I know. All right. Let, let me, let me, uh, let me, is, is there a, a lizard man version of courage? Because if I were king of the forest, uh, all right, um, hmm. technically the shortest path is south. Is he going to attack me first? All right, let's walk away and head north first. Because, uh, oh, hi. I want to explore all the area first. I know that's going to... I hope that's going to be important later. That's the thought. Uh, oh! So the, the beast trick will work on these guys. I might have to try that on one of them. See if it's actually worth learning. I don't think it is. I really don't think it is. Like, if they hadn't given it to me, I don't think I would have spent the uh, force powers to, to learn it. On a grenade and some components. And, ooh. Oh. Nothing's there. What about this damage console? Nothing. Log out. Alright. Hmm. Uh, nope, not there. I need to go this way. And what is at the end of this valley? The Jolly Green Giant. No. Uh, a beautiful view of the entrance to something on Malachor 5. Hmm. I wonder what that could be. Frieden Nod's Blaster? Um... I think we've already found one of those already, and I, I can't remember if somebody's equipped it or if uh, we ended up using it for parts. Either way, it's not going to do us much good. I, I kind of wish that the, the loot table adjusted for that fact that you're really not, you're, you're not going to get anything of value here. It, you just, it would be nice, but you're not. All right, Force Wave doesn't really seem to be affecting these guys. And since there's only the one, I don't see, ooh, stasis works though. I think the next time there's like two or three of those guys, I'll try the beast trick to see if I can get one to fight the other. That's stasis though. Why haven't why, why haven't I been using that before? Like that blaster. That, it, give me give me give me some medbacks, some life support. I don't know something anything anything that's not that. Hey beach duck, thanks for sticking around. Have fun tomorrow. We'll, uh, we'll be back with more. There'll be more coming. Alright, let's, uh... Okay, prototype shield. Oh yeah, th this is gonna be another one of those, uh, amaze of twisty passages that all look alike. Because there's a lot of loot backs, and I know I need to get down, uh, pointing with the mouse, but you can't see the mouse because for some reason these games never seem to really uh, capture the cursor when you're in game mode like this. Oh, I thought I led with that, but maybe not. I 
thought. Dude, you might want to put the lightsaber away. <laughs> Running with a lightsaber does not seem the good way to live a happy and long life. Alright, yeah. Um, hmm. Yeah, this is going to take a little while to explore it all, isn't it? Hi. He's stunned. Run up there and do something about it. Oh, man. That's so much easier. I like that. And that just lit up a whole bunch of the caverns, so let me head to the right. Right. I think this is the area I want to follow. With a little less of the ominous music. I mean, really, none of these guys have been so so difficult that uh warranted the ominous. Dun dun dun. All right. Uh, nope. That goes back that way. This goes back. Oh, there's a dead body. I've clearly been there. <laughs> I love how that's the signifier. You see the dead bodies? Yep, I've been there. Alright, this is that Republic ship that I was looking for with another corpse. That has some grenades that could be useful for somebody. Possibly. And a damaged console that has minimal power. And my only option is to log out. I thought there was something that we were supposed to do there. Or maybe that comes later. Alright, let's just face this M. And go ahead. Get in on. Okay, I was getting worried there. I thought for somehow I had missed the big standing lizard guy that was right there in front of me. Like, how does that happen? How do you miss the big ginormous lizard right in front of you with a lightsaber? Don't, don't answer that, Arcadius. That only works if we're going by my actual dice rolls. That... <laughs> you're not supposed to... You're not supposed to laugh at my misery. Except when you're a GM. That, then GMs always laugh at players' misery. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Uh, okay. Not always. Hero's Quest. You're not the GM in Hero's Quest. What do you mean doesn't count? You said name a game. You're always the GM. I named a game. Can't change the rules. What do you think you are, Congress? Uh-oh. That's a bigger beastie. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and do that. No, oh, I didn't mean to do it twice. And let's hit him with a stasis field. <laughs> yeah, okay. You keep telling yourself that. Oh, that stasis did nothing to him. Gotcha. Oh, but that flurry. Oh, two flurries. Okay. <laughs> the bigger they are. <laughs> Close the doors. Unleash the beastie. Whack, whack. Uh, open the doors. Forget about the beastie. I mean, you ought to get a full set of armor out of that dude, right? Oh, no, sorry. Wrong game. Some components. Storm Beast. There's a big old entry lake. You know, here's this big beastie. Beware the beast. Nasty fangs and big pointy teeth. Oh, wait, no. Wrong franchise. Um... Nothing? No loot? 
Come on. You're, you're giving me what's supposed to obviously be a big, bad... Okay, fine. The big, bad, no loot. That's a shame. That's just a shame. A genuine tragedy. Alright, fair warning. Y you may hear the sounds of a puppy furiously eating in the background. It's because it's about an hour past his uh, dinner time. Because uh, I've been going long a lot today. That's okay. I hope you're having fun with it. Getting you the useless loot I will stop complaining about. For a little bit. Alright, let me go ahead and save the game here real quick. Because I'm pretty sure we're going to trigger something in a minute. That, that ominous door is ominous. Uh, okay. There's an assassin so well hidden, he's uh, in the middle, <laughs> he's, he's in the ground. Judging from the number and death of blaster burns, these Sith appear to have been recently killed by fire from a heavy repeater. Oh, come on, I, I, see, I see the reticle that says there should be loot on him. Then who's got a heavy repeater? Oh, Mandalore? Where art thou, O oh Mandalore? You're the only one I know toting around a heavier repeater. Anything else over here? No. Nothing else over here? Hello. Loot boxes. Oh wait, no, 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 that's right. This isn't uh, EA built Star Wars. There are no loot boxes. Oh, sorry. Too soon. can't help it, but they make themselves such an easy target. Especially for that kind of stuff. Well, I thought the puppy was going to get fed. He should get fed. Please feed the puppy. It's okay. I don't... Feed him. We'll, we'll be okay with the background noise. Uh-oh. Cutscene. I knew something was up. Alright, boys. You want to dance? Let's dance. You got enough? Are you sure? I don't think you got enough. Oh. Well, that... That's not what I expected. That is not what I expected at all. I say we fire a rocket at her right now. And blow her screen <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna work. Into the heart of this planet. It wouldn't work. If there were other distractions, maybe. If she wasn't telepathic, maybe. If you want to kill her like that, you need something else to occupy her attention. Otherwise, you might just wound her, and then we'd all be in trouble. This hmm. battle will not be decided by weapons. You are wrong. Manipulation is Kreia's strength, not battle. Let us see what transpires, and plan our attack. Yeah. Um. Hmm. You know, I haven't seen Bowder since we uh, got to Citadel Station. If you are watching this, and what the general suspected was true, the Sith are striking from the graveyard of Manacor 5. The ship the Sith Lord was on was one of the vessels damaged in that final battle. If you reach Malakor's surface, the mass shadow generator can be undone. Provided there are enough vessels intact within the orbiting debris or buried in the planet's surface. Uh. Use a sequence I am unlocking in your memory banks on the engine core of any vessel you encounter on Malakor. If my calculations are correct, four vessels should be enough to power up the mass shadow generator and undo the damage that was done in Malakor 5. The damage I did. Uh, okay, so it was something that I told them to do. Cannot be stopped. So make sure the general is off the planet before triggering the sequence. Otherwise... There will be no retreat. I know your weapon systems are minimal, but I don't know what awaits you on Malakor's surface. <laughs> Try to avoid contact with any potential threats. Follow your programming. Your programming commands you to find the four vessels buried within Malakor's surface and activate the engines on each one. Okay. I knew there was something we needed to do on there. 
When the engine systems are activated, it will disrupt the gravitonic anomaly that is keeping the planetoids fused together. Malachor 5 will begin to drift apart. Warning, you have no offensive weapons, and if you are destroyed, then you will have failed your mission. Travel across this planet as fast as you can to hit each of the points and activate the engine systems one at a time. Okay, then. Uh, oh. Well, at least, I mean, I got access to everything. Yeah. Mass shadow generator. All right. Let's, uh, you know what, let's go ahead and save this. Because, uh, no offensive weapons? That that sounds like a recipe for failure. Out of curiosity. Okay. Uh, remote combat droid one. You cannot equip or remove an item from any of these slots. Alright, so all you got is a little... Field survival pistol, and you can't equip anything? Nothing. Alright. That's back to the ship. Where is Berodur? Because I, I really, I really wonder, where is he? Alright, at least we've got the map. So we need to head to this Republic ship in the north first. I wonder if uh, all the critters that we cleared means that the remote won't have to deal with any of those. Are the uh, corpses... No, the corpses still hold new loot. Oh, that wasn't it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Oh, uh, yeah. Let, let me go. Yeah, and this is gonna alt tab out of there real quick. I'll, I'll I'll allow that. Although I do try to I do try to keep it as uh, family friendly as I can. Just uh, just so you know. All right. Let's uh. Yeah, that that is weird. Although. Although, I don't know, I, I, I've seen followers go up and down from time to time, too, so... It, it is one of those things. Ah, that's it. That's okay. Uh, let's enter in our sequence. Alright. XP received. Nice. And now we need to get to... Oh, out there. We need to get to the generator in the south. Okay. So, it wasn't a waste of time to map all this stuff out. And where am I? I'm here. Where do I need to be? Nope, not there. But there. I'm going to take the next right and the right after that. I, I am glad that they, they did uh, let all the bad guys that I cleared stay cleared for this part. That would... That would not be good. Oh, oh. There's my turn. I mean, this is a fun little game and all, but... Uh, this is... This feels slightly unnecessary. All right, is tr walking across this bridge going to trigger something? No. Are we are we actually going to get another fight with Hanhar or no? Apparently not. Okay. Um, where was it? All right, straight ahead and follow that rocky ridge. And here? Yes, yes. Hit the console. Enter the sequence for priming the mass generator. All right, there we go. XP. Always nice. I mean, I guess it would be nice if I could level this guy up, but I don't know that it would actually do anything. I mean, 
I got all these extra droid parts. Let, let me let me equip the little guy. Let me put something on him. I got all this armor and stuff. I mean, yes, his whole job is literally just float around to the four Republic sites and activate them. And I kind of I kind of wish that they would have just like let the story happen. You know, um, instead of forcing you to do this, just have Baodur instruct his remote and uh, and then just let that be a cutscene where the droid floats around to everywhere that you cleared. Okay. Because this, th this feels needlessly time-consuming and tedious. And I'm not a fan of those sorts of things in the game. Uh, where's that other? That's the other. I'm going to follow that down. Just kind of stay with the wall on my left. Oh, nothing on there. Alright, I already got that. Yeah, this this feels very unnecessary. I mean, I get it from a storytelling perspective. I do like what it adds to the... Because you finally find out what Bowder did here at your command. We know it was at your command from previous conversations, but still. 98%. If you are hearing this, then the sequence has been completed when active. It will destroy Malakor. Again, I have one last command for you. Where are you? You must remain behind and ensure that the sequence fires properly once the general gives the command. If not, then all we have fought for has been for nothing. You have done hmm. all I asked, all you have built for, and for that, I thank you. Oh. Oh. Um. Touching the probability of the Iridonian installing trigger commands within your core was high. I see the probabilities have played out. Of course, the probability that I would do the same is equally high. Your inability to move hmm. right now is evidence of that. If the general issues the command, only I will be here to receive it. You realize I cannot permit you. Actually, presence is needed to stabilize the galaxy. No, without them, the galaxy will be reduced to anarchy within years. No, I'm, I'm not buying and that one. Anything I can't stand, it's an untidy galaxy. So, <laughs> let us wait okay. here, you and I, for the general's orders and calculate the probable fate of the galaxy. Correction. What could rust listening to your speeches for? Oh. Perhaps it is the large unwieldy vocabulary. Okay, so this is where these guys are. Frame ...that prevents your calculations from taking oh. me into account. And while I find this small droid annoying in the extreme, I find my urge to shoot you takes a higher <laughs> priority. Unfortunately for you, I have arranged for friends to meet me here, and you seem to have brought none of your own. Stop him. Unexpected correction. We cannot harm that unit. <laughs> it is a violation of our self-preservation programming. Statement. As always, that one, you have miscalculated. Ah, uh, an unfortunate oversight. What was that? Statement. I understand. Assassination protocols activated. Let us see what you have in your arsenal, that one. All I wish was to fulfill my programming. Either way, the Republic is doomed. Observation. <laughs> I thought he would never die. Well, that was... That was entertaining. Now we know where they are. Oh, movie time. Oh, no! The ship! 
I think I've seen this movie. The ship still survives, somehow. Maybe? Hopefully? Please? We've come a long way, Kreia. Still far to go. Ah, the Huntress. Come alone. You are braver than I thought. She is not alone. We stand with her. And with her stand all the Jedi. And now okay. I come in saying something suitably heroic. <laughs> Thank you. Children with lightsabers, but not Jedi, I think. Come close. Let me look upon you and see what the exile's teaching has forged. An assassin, a slayer of her own kin, a blinded slave, and a fool. Which of you wishes to try yourselves against me? As you can see, I am unarmed. You, perhaps. Come, child. Where you walk, it is not far from battle, slaughter, and the blood of your sisters. Uh oh. Why do I get the feeling that this is not going to go as anybody planned? Yeah. Mm -mm. So don't go at her one at a time. This is not how you win. Gang up upon her. Have I not taught you anything? Your lusts unfulfilled, a dance unfinished, a love requited. Think before you give it up so quickly. And you, blind one, you have hungered to strike me down ever since you saw the bond the exile and I share. Can you feel the force running through me, even past the veil, past your blooded eyes? You know you cannot win. The force runs strong within you, Treya. But in the howling of a storm, it is difficult to hear the whisper of the blade. <laughs> you you tell her. been the blind one. You were given a gift few are ever given, and yet you let your gift of sight warp you, twist. You think your existence under your lord was torture, Miraluka? I will make you see an assassin. Mm. Oh, wait, wait, what, what are you doing running? Don't run. I taught you better than that. Get back in there and fight, you coward. Yeah. And I get the fool. Hm. Funny. That's just what I was thinking. Oh, okay, so we will get a chance to dance this dance. Alright, let's do the wave. Let's get some energy resistance. And I probably should have given you some better uh better powers. Huh. Live and learn, you hope. Oh, and before we do that, let's go ahead and level up. Because that might help. Um, shoot. Nothing's going to provide immediate benefit, so we'll... we'll yeah, okay. Skills, treat injuries, stealth, demolitions, powers. Ooh, ooh, this is my last chance to get something good out of you. Um, I got a funny feeling this battle was doomed anyway. But, on the off chance, what do I need? Um, you get support power, force suppression? I mean, that looks like it should help. But I'm thinking I might either... Defense 2, Defense 2. Uh -huh. Let's do burst of speed. Okay. Okay. And switch to the saver. And then see how this goes. Do I have flurry? No, I don't have flurry. Now I'm kind of wishing I'd spent some time doing flurries and such. Alright. Ooh. Get him! Get him! You might just win this day. Oh, maybe not. That power attack, though. Oh! Oh! 
Uh, let's do that heal first. And then let's get one of these guys. Heal. Oh. Run away for a second. cycling between the two. <laughs> yeah, I don't think this is going to go well. Although, honestly, I'm not entirely sure we're intended to win this one. just happened there? Oh, I totally forgot to switch back to the, the game and camera. Nope. Oops. Um. When the exile enters Treyas Academy, he will be faced with a choice. Okay. What choice is that? One path, assuming he survives, will allow him to save his friends, but he shall be the weaker for it. Hmm. The other route will lead him directly to this place, through the ones that have hounded his steps from the beginning, and he shall have his vengeance. Yeah. Show him every respect when he arrives in these halls, Lord yeah. Zion. Every, I every respect. Uh, I get what you mean. He probably does too. Oh, all right, all right, we'll take care of you guys first. Uh, and then we'll probably insert a little break. Ooh, I like XP. I don't think it's going to be enough to do much, but... All right. Let's get these guys. They're going to get up all close and stuff. <laughs> For all the good it does them. Uh, let's get the weaklings out. Oh, never mind. They all are. And we get a nice short lightsaber. Okay. Hmm. That's back to the Malachor Depths. All right, you know what? Let's uh, let's do like I just said. Uh, let's save this game real quick. Save. Okay. And let's take a short break. Well, that was fun. Unless I just died, then it was a little less than fun. I hope you've enjoyed. I hope you're having fun. And if you want to watch live, you can follow along on Twitch. I live stream the recording of the next six episodes at least once a week. I might even throw in some bonus content here and there if time allows. And you'll find the link in the description below. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you'll get notified when new episodes go up live stream archives from some of my other stuff and various and sundry other videos because I do more than just this. And if you want to get notifications, don't forget to hit the bell. And if you really, truly enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and all that good fun stuff. If you have any questions, queries, quips, quotes, comments, complaints, or other whatnot, don't forget to leave those in the comments down below. Lastly, 
if you're enjoying the show, if you're getting some value out of it, then consider giving a lot of value back. Go to live.anonjunior.com. It'll take you to the Streamlabs page where you can tip or donate, however you want to think about it. And there's no preset amount because this is a straight up value for value proposition. So if you're getting value out of the show and you would like to give a little value back, even if it's just enough for a cheap cup of coffee, then uh, consider going, giving a little bit, especially if it tickled the nostalgia or opened your eyes to a new game that you might play. And uh, with all that said and done, we're, uh, we're going to cut out, have fun, enjoy, and I'll see you next time.